What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Chatty Bobby, eleven thirty, Battle Rap Dusty Roads. I mean, I'm just a motherfucking common man living an American dream, and I got some motherfucking bionic elbows. I don't care if I cuss and I don't get monetized. You know what I mean? I can't censor myself. Okay, don't make me. Just got done watching JC obliterate O Red on the app. Um, this was sad, man. And the reason I say it was sad is that. JC and Oops battle would have been so much better on RBE, bro. Couple of reasons. One, O-Red didn't give the first flying fuck about this battle. He was rapping like this. And a foe's in a this. And a did a bow. You see, because such and such was rhyming such and such. Y'all catch up. That's what he did the whole battle. The whole battle. He had a few cool lines. The crowd did not give a shit about O-Ren this whole battle. But I'll tell you why I don't feel sorry for him. Because he didn't give him a reason to give a shit. Because he was he was up there with no energy, rapping all lazy. He was acting like they were dumb because they wasn't reacting to his punchlines. Some of them were cool. Some of them were whack. Some of them were all right. But instead of just rhyming through it, he's doing what all these other rap. Chess was doing it too. Think about it. Like, no, we already are. If it was that dope, we'd have cheered. You know why I say that? JC had no problem getting reaction because JC was spitting some very hot shit. And JC was trying and he was delivering well. He had a good stage presence and he gave a shit. So the crowd liked that. This wasn't JC's hometown. It was in Atlanta. He's not from Atlanta. He's from Pontiac. The closest round is the first. O Red's on Twitter trying to act, trying to say he won the first round. Stop. The first round was close. I, I edged it to JC. You could maybe I could see you edging it to O Red, but there's no way in hell that he won rounds two and three. JC clearly, I mean, he just it was just a body. Um, and but it, nobody cares though. They already battled once before, and when they battled before, they battled two rounds. Who the fuck does a two-round battle? What kind of league is it? If you can't afford all three, then just do one round, unlimited. Why are you doing two rounds? Like, the only one I give a two-rounder excuse for is Hollow the Don and Averb. And that's because when they were when they were battling, people were still wearing baggy clothes, okay? People were still wearing Jabot jeans and, and fucking just baggy-ass shit. The dip set was still... A, 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 a happening force, okay? So I give that an ex I give that an excuse. That that's, but this was like three or four years ago they battled a two rounder. Stop it! Nobody cares about two rounder. I'm not quoting any lines. I mean, there was some cool lines from each one of them. Mainly JC. O Red had a couple, but he makes me. It makes me so mad when when rappers do this. If we're watching the battle, newsflash: we understand bars, okay? Just because we don't react to the bars, don't treat us like we're fucking five-year-olds. Like with the little bouncy ball. See, because you know that was a JC flip I just did. Pat me on back. Pat back. I did a JC. I know it was a JC flip. Wasn't that good. Crowd didn't think it was that good. We don't need you to tell us it was a JC flip because you said somebody's name that started with a J. Last name started with a C. Not rocket science, O-Red. Wasn't dope. You ever think of that? That's the thing. Y'all don't think, y'all can't think that some of your stuff that you say may not be good. You just think everything you say, ugh. You just think everything that you say is the dopest shit you've ever said. And if we don't react to it, then we're the dumb ones. No. Oh, Reg, you lost. You lost clear. To me, you lost every round. You lost the second, third, very clear. And you got edged in the first. You're coming out with that T in a, in a styrofoam cup, you was, nobody cared, bro. You didn't care, and the crowd and, and the crowd sensed it, and they didn't give a shit about you because you didn't give a shit. Very simple. Um, this is do, this does nothing for either one of them, and the reason why I say that's because O Red's already booked on the next card, and so is JC. So it, it doesn't doesn't matter. That's what I'm saying. URL has made it to where mainly URL. It doesn't, Twerk's booked on the next card against against Swamp. Doesn't matter if you, if you don't care. Smack doesn't care. 
because they're getting so much money, they don't give a shit if you try, really. Because they're not, I mean, they don't care about YouTube anymore. It goes up on the app that they're getting $8 a month for it, regardless if you think it's any good. Whether you click on the O-Red JC battle or not, Smack's still getting $8 of your money every month. It's not like YouTube. You know what I mean? So it is what it is, man. We'll see both of them again. They'll be, I mean, Red will be good again. I mean, he was good against Chess. But he just didn't care about this battle. So why take it? For the bag, I get it, Chad. The bag was so stupid, he couldn't help it. Whatever. You got fucking 30 But it doesn't matter. You'll be back. I don't remember who you battle next. I don't remember who JC battled. I don't remember who anybody battles. All of it's running together. Did y'all think that it was close? Because I didn't. Subscribe to the channel. Peace.